Mac and I's favorite episode this year, I would have to say is Tarpon. You know, when we first did our pilot episode to pitch to the networks and the sponsors that we were capable of even editing over 12 minutes, it was done on Tarpon. You know, you'll notice at the end of that episode that there's a, there's a single shot of me on the rocks and that shot means a lot to Mac and I. You know, that was the ending shot. That was the starting point of this successful hey, future that we've feet, been on. This fish is trying to take you on that ledge that's like 45. So if you can keep her up, keep her up. Looks like she's coming up. Come on up. She's gonna jump right in the boat. No pressure or anything, but you got an expensive camera on the boat and we're the only boat hooked up. So make it happen. Now she's back in the other school. I don't think it's happening soon, though. She found her ass right back in there. There's so many fish down there. I feel them tail slapping the line every other second. Every time that fish goes for a run, it's just fish, 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 fish. It's crazy how we hooked this fish up in 12 feet of water, and now it's taking us all the way over here to the 70-foot hole. It hasn't jumped once yet. Hasn't come close. Which is like usually a huge indication that it's a big girl. Ooh, it might come up now, though. Come on, man. Man, it has been a heck of a journey from that day to where we are now. I mean, things are completely different. Things are bigger. Things that we've always wanted to accomplish have been accomplished. Now there's even newer and bigger goals that we never thought we would even be trying to obtain, but we have no direction but going up right now, you know? Mac and I are always motivating one another to push the envelope, to make something that nobody else is in this industry. You know, we, we really feel like we're trying to create outside the box. We're, we're, we're trying to figure out new angles, new ways, new facts, a new way to present information to people that enjoy fishing and the outdoors life as much as I do, as much as Mac does. I mean, Mac still has me whooped. I mean, his largemouth bass is like something crazy, like 14 pounds, Mac? 14 pounds. Actually, you know what? We're actually gonna have him insert his photo here of this fish, because it's insane. Can't tell you how he caught it, but he caught it. It's got me whooped. Can't, I don't know if I'll ever even beat that, but it's cool to film with somebody, and I mean, Mac and I are together a lot. There's a lot of 12 hour days, and a lot of talking, and there's a huge age gap between Mac and I of almost 13 years, so it's really fun to find things that Mac and I can relate to with one another, especially being 13 years different in age, so. I love always telling Mac things that I know that intrigues him and vice versa. I mean, Mac's always giving me information that's really intriguing. I think that's what's made our relationship so good. That's what I feel like our, our work is so good because of the communication him and I have. And that is something that we're really proud of. And hopefully we just keep getting better at it, you know, just for you guys. Because season two, what you're about to watch was a lot of hard work, but it's a lot of fun.
So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. You know, it was fun. So, without further ado, Goliath Fishing presents Season 2.